All right, all kinds of crazy crap just happened to me. So I uh, was going to do one video. Apparently there's going to be two. Let me get you guys situated here. In the first video, I just was telling everybody that I, I never watched this one. This is the one uh, yesterday. She's deleted a few since then. Um, it's when she's in the room and she's, you know, telling everybody that she hates them and that, you know, uh, she's not going back and blah, blah, blah. There's, you know, she's not, she's got too much THC. She's not going to buy anymore. Yada, yada, yada. You know, shit we heard before. Um, so I am, I just did my eyebrows because I got these little tiny, this is the comparison. I got a three pack of these little tiny beauty blinders. They're so sing and cute. And then this is the comparison when it's wet. Um, these are for like, if you want to get underneath your eye and stuff like that. If my mom doesn't leave me alone, I am going to take my brother's snacks. I promise. So anyway, it's the comparison and you know, you just, you can get into all those like little areas where, you know, when you're putting your primer on your eye, it'll soak up the rest of that, um, you know, so nothing pulls in the creases or the folds of your eye. So I got this in my Alta haul today. I'm going to quick do my eyes. I found in my, you know, my arsenal over here in there. Um, I'm going to try this. I found some lashes and I found some adhesive liquid liner. And I believe that these came together, but they're not the same name. But um, why not? I got to go take my brother. Oh, my brother's not feeling well. He's a, It's just this whole big thing. I don't want to get into it, but he wants snacks. I got to take him snacks. So I'm going to put her back on. And uh, first, let me take a drink of water. And we'll get into it, shall we? Oh, that went down the wrong pipe. So I did do my face with, you know, everything else. And, uh... Oh, camera cut out. So, set everything into place. Yup, yeah, I did. I wanted to get like a hand fit, hand fan, but I just see. Everybody else has them. And you know, then I saw these kitty cat ones and uh, this kitty cat fan and I'm like, yep, gotta have it. Plus, it's bad. It's a USB charger. You don't think I'm gonna charge this and, and take that shit out and, eat, and when it starts to get really hot? <laughs> I... This is my handbag that I carry for the summer. Shit just goes in there. It'll fit. Yeah, it will. Um, also, in my Alta haul, I bit the bullet and I actually bought one. I got a Stila and I got the color Ocean. Kitten was in my wish list on Sephora for a very long time. So when I went to Alta today, I swatched it. And uh, this one is the bee's knees. So I kind of have an idea as to what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to pull out my, uh, I have the Natasha Denona. This is the Ayana. I have not seen it on her website. This I got from BoxyCharm. So I don't know if you can actually purchase this on her website or not. Um, I have the Jubilee and I have Ayana. In fact, I have two Ayanas. So I'm not going to um, dip into the brand new one. I have a Z palette with those colors. This blue is from the Jubilee. So all of these other colors are from the Ayana. So um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do like a wash. And then I want this on there and then do like the liner with the the, the lashes. Like, you know, I, I, I just got into the eyebrow game. I'm going to start playing with the... Uh, 
I'm going to start playing in, in lashes, right? Oh, uh, I'm kind of scared. Hmm. I think I'll just do this as the transition. There's those round ones that are in there are, um, ColourPop. I just depotted a couple of, uh, I just depotted a couple of palettes that I had because everything was starting to get a little too cumbersome over here in my little corner in the bedroom. So I just took the colors out that I didn't use and I put them in a larger Z palette. FYI, if you're going to, if you're going to depot palettes, um, watch some videos on how to. Otherwise, you're going to ruin your comforter on your bed because, you know, you're sitting there watching some idiot inhale and talk about, uh, you know, boyfriend problems. And you'll have all kinds of glitter all over your, your comforter. R.I.P. R.I.P. Comforter. Just gave me an excuse to buy a new one because I love new bedding. I uh, I would buy bedding like this asshole buys underwear if I could. I love changing my bedding. I have my, I have my uh, spring one on now. It's like spring, summer. And then I have one for like fall, winter. But I'd actually like to get a spring one, a summer, a, you know, I just get the duvets. That's because the inside is the actual blanket. But, um, yeah, I mean, you know, it's what happens when you have a house and you're all grown up. You put your underwear in the washing machine and you buy utensils. Measuring cups. Pyrex dishes. So when you're shredding cheese, you're not putting in an actual cat bowl. I said what I said. Anyway, I don't even know if I feel like listening to this bitch. All right, so I'm going to keep this brush out because it has some of that transition color in there. I'm going to grab my other blending brush and I'm going to dip into... See, this is... God, it's so hard to tell because... Uh, let me see some... Uh, Tasha, you kill me. All right, let's see that. And I don't, well, I mean, and this one's just, well, that actually might look better. All right, I'm going to go into the darker, um, the darker brown here. And I'm just going to, like, do my uh, crease. So... I put that steel on and it has like some dimension to it, you know, just blow this out so it doesn't, you know, look that bad. I love this brush. I am telling you, if they had, they sold out. I think it said like there's only two in stock when I put it in my, my basket and uh, I haven't seen it since. It's a Marc Jacobs. It's called The Crease. And... Yeah, if this bad boy wasn't on sale, it wouldn't be in my collection. I don't buy shit on, I don't buy shit full price. I'm telling you, I did that shit one time. My grandmother yelled at me and it was for my niece. She's like, was it for her second birthday? I got her a, uh, I was just thinking cute, the outfit, but I couldn't help myself. It came with like, you know, 
a little shirt and some jeans. I mean, there's nothing cuter than a, a two-year-old in jeans. And uh, it's like kind of like a poncho shirt, like a pheasant shirt. It was so stinking cute. And it had like silver embroidery and uh, little jeans with it and silver uh, sandals. I couldn't help myself. But because I couldn't help myself, I wound up spending an arm and a leg on a two-year-old's outfit. Grandma said, oh my gosh, where'd you get that? I said, oh, I got it at a uh, baby gap. And she's like, really? That, cause her birthday's in uh, January, my niece. And uh, my girl's like, well, they have the spring stuff out yet already? I said, yeah. She goes, how much was that? And she never asked. You know, she was never one to ask like about money or whatever. Cause well, I mean, we talked about it cause we got, we got, when we got bargains, we would be like, hey, look at this. And uh, I was like, I, 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 and I told her, she's like, why have I taught you? I said, I know, I know, I know. She goes, well, it is cute though. I said, mm-hmm. I think that's like the only thing I ever bought full price. Oh, uh, I, I, I had to buy it. I had to buy it. And, I, and you know, I don't even think I saw my niece in it. Not even a picture. So when I go see my brother and bring him his snacks, I'm going to smack him. My niece is going to be 16 this year. Oh my gosh, the time flies. <sighs> Beat his ass or something that happened 14 years ago. You know, I love my brother. I hear banging on my door. I know it's him. You know, banging on the door like she gets the cops coming for. I get banging on the door because my brother's like, I got to poop. He just wants to come in and talk shit. Uh, he does poop too, so. You better spray. He swears his stuff don't stink. And I'm like, dude, you're, 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 you're an actual sale. You, you like, you, you, you know. I mean, I'm putting makeup on talking about my brother's shit in my house. What the hell's wrong with me? Anyway, the point is, is that I love my brother and he comes over and uh, poops and then we gossip about things. He'll call me out and he'll be like, hey, did you watch The Housewives today? What? Since when did you start watching The Housewives? And he knows more about it than I do. I'm like, what? And then don't get it twisted. My brother is a man's man. Like, I mean, you know, he out there working in the, in the elements every day. You know, doing, doing labor. He works his ass off. But, you know, ever since he got a smartphone, he's, you know, all up in the housewives business. So it's been going on for years. I know my brother likes the housewives. Mm. <laughs> if I call him and I tell him, like, yo, you got to check out this show. It's so good. He's like, um, yeah, I started watching it the first episode. I'm like, you couldn't call me and tell me about this show? Like, seriously? Like, Power on Stars? I didn't know until it was three seasons deep. But I caught, you know, I mean, like I caught up and then I was up to date and the season, um, you know, when they ended the series, he hadn't had a chance to watch it. I was like, all right, I won't ruin it for you. But for those of you that did watch it, Tommy's finale, she gave me chills at the end. When I get in the car, I'm going to put some RNG on. Thank you, ladies. Mount up. All right. Um, so, I think that this is... I think I'm kind of happy with that. 
you know, like I said, I'm going to, I can't wait. This is going to be my favorite part. <laughs> All right. So again, um, this one's called ocean steel of products. I mean, the liquid shadows, like the, duh, they're the best, right? You know, Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, Coco's under my legs, banging her head up against the, my stool here. All right, I'll let that dry. That's one coat. It's absolutely beautiful in person. It's absolutely stunning. Absolutely beautiful. I wish the applicator was more, more like a brush. You know, this is kind of like, um, you know, like a lip gloss type kind of thing. If I get one more text message that he's like starving, he's gonna get his ass kicked. Like, dude, you're not starving. Oh, uh, what you want, homie? I mean, I know what he wants. Oh, no, this is going to be Starburst. No, you shouldn't eat Starburst. I'm in dentistry, trust me. But I eat cupcakes, he eats Starburst. Is in the uh, Alti called and he's like, I'm withering away. Uh, homie, no, you're not. No, you're not. We had a, um, we had a doctor come in who she, you know, she's a, a, a specialist. She's an orthodontist and she came to introduce herself to our practice because we're general and, um, you know, it happens like, you know, the specialists will come into the general doctors and introduce themselves and, you know, try to get referrals from our office. So, yeah, okay. No big deal. Um, she brought in and handed me a box that was probably, it had to be about six pounds worth of pastries. When I tell you that these things were, um, amazing, it was yesterday. And then today, uh, me and one of the girls was left there and I said, no, 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 we're not leaving this because it was open in the office. I said, no grab, grab some stuff. We're going to, you know, we're going to take this home. We'll split it or whatever. Cause I can't leave it there over a long weekend. Like it'll literally, it, it's going to go bad or we're going to walk into, you know, a horde of bugs or, you know, whatever. And she's like, no, I can't take them home. It'll go to waste. I'm telling you. So I'm like, I can't leave them here. And I wasn't going to throw them out. So guess what? I'm going to take my brother some muffins. Here, here's some muffins. And, uh, I mean, they had like, it's got plain croissants in it, Danish muffins, cookies. And it's from a, like a bakery. I was like, where's this bakery at? Thank God it's far away. Cause I can't handle that. I already have a good, I already have an, I already know a good bakery. I don't need to have another one in, in uh, you know, 
around the corner. So, I'm going to go see my brother. And he's going to be like, where the frig are you going? What the frig's going on here? Steal it. That's what's going on here. So, I don't know if you can tell what it looks like. But, um, mm-hmm. Yeah. It's, you know, it's, it's just enough. It's not overwhelming. The other colors that I saw, they were kind of like, uh, like foil. And I didn't want that look. I wanted something that was softer. So, um, like kitten wasn't bad. They had kitten and then they had kitten kaleidoscope. So there was two. Kitten was a little bit more of that, that, um, like kind of metal look, but not bad. Not, not too, too bad. There was one that I picked up and I did, and I was like, oh, that just looks like foil. Um, and then, so I tried the four on and when I, I kept going back and I'm like, you know what, if I don't pick ocean up, I'm going to regret it. It's one of those things. Like if you guys have a home goods around you, if you see something you like, you better grab it because it's not going to be there next time you go. Because they don't keep that shit in stock. And Ocean was the last one. It was the the one I grabbed. It was the last one. All right, don't dick me over here. What's going on? Why can't I? Oh, just whatever. <sighs> I remember that. I know I'm like worrying about like you know, getting up to him to give him Starburst. So anyway, I'm just going to make sure that this, you know doesn't look it looks you know like it's just clean it up a little bit I guess that's what I'm trying to say I got all twisted I mean like you know the tornado driving home in that crap doing the video talking shit on this one and now, like, you know, my video going off, and now I got to go take my brother's, you know, starbursts. I never did. I, I, what am I supposed to do? Do mascara first? And then put that shit on? I guess so, right? All right, let's get it. L -l -l let's do this. If I look like an ass, I take all my makeup off. It's no big deal. It's only makeup that comes off. All right, all right. If you didn't watch the eyebrow one, uh, Sisters Not Twins, I say it all the time. We don't talk about hair around here. The fan's on all the time. But I'm trying, like, there's this one piece. I have a scar in this eye. So there's a little bit of hair growing, which is what I've been trying to do. But because of the scar next to it, it's like a bald patch that I can't get. And if I put, if I put the, like, the pencil in there, then it just, it, it just looks too much. So, I mean, you know, they don't, it doesn't look bad. I mean, I'll go out in public like this. So, uh, you know, I, oh man, was I supposed to do this first? I'm going to keep my underneath my eye. I'm not going to do anything because I feel like there'll be too much going on uh, with the lashes. I should probably put some sort of color in my waterline, huh? I'm telling you, I'm all jacked up over here. I'm all jacked up. So, where we left off over there is Num Nuts was talking about, you know, how she's duped and she can't believe it and all that shit. It's just the same thing. I'm telling you right now, she's up there in Montreal. She went studio apartment shopping. It's all lies and all money grab. But this is where she, you know, this live is where she admitted, um, where she said that Dee Dee got, uh, you know, 
let go of the job for the April Fool's prank. All right, you want to play online? You're going to do the time. Cracks me up when people call out. And then they go down, especially around here, like, because the shores are so close. So, you know, I'll get a call out. Oh, I have a migraine. I've been up throwing up all night. You know, I'm not feeling good. Okay, feel better. Take it easy. And, you know, somebody in the office comes out to me and shows me that they're on, they're at the beach. I'm like, oh, okay, well, I guess their migraine went away. Because I tell people, I'm like, look, I, don't lie to me. Just don't lie to me. If you're going to call out and I have to find a replacement or I'm going to be short staffed, just tell me the truth. Like, you need a mental day. You're taking a personal day. You just need a mental day because I know I have them. It, just tell me the truth. Because then when you come in, I'm going to tell you about yourself. The thing, did your migraine go away so you just got off the phone with me? And if that's why your ass is on the beach. Or, and then they come back the next day and they got like this beautiful tan. I'm like, just don't lie. Like, I, I totally, I, I'm like, I get it. You need a head day. Okay, fine. I hear you. I see you. Oh, people pray for me on this one. You know, this might not even happen, okay, because check this out. Um, I have no clue what I'm doing. First, let's get the uh, scissors. Put my fucking eyeball out because I can't see shit, right? Now, I know I should go in here. It should be popped. In order Alright, I'm going to put that on the mirror. You stay right there, okay, sir? I'll be back. Don't miss me. Like, do I have to put this eyeliner on? Or, like, is it... I am legit sticking these things to my mirror. Wait, what are we doing with the waterline? What do you think? Should I put a little sun something in there? What do I got over here? I got all kinds of cute colors. I mean, I have the, no, that's too hot pink. This is white, that's too purple. I thought I had, I have a nude. That's purple. Um, let's see. This is a light blue, but it's not. I mean, it, it's coming across as just like a nice, uh, just kind of open the eye up. It's not really coming across blue. Technically, I could use the nude. Or white. You know, black closes your eye out. You know, it makes your eye look smaller. Nude and white gives it like that brighter, you know, more open look. So, uh, all right. Again, if this shit don't work, I'm just take all my stuff off. I'll be pissed because I like this color. A 
legitimately can't do this and talk. I am not good at, at like doing wings. That's supposed to be an adhesive liner. I don't know. The hell's the difference? It's Memorial Day weekend. It's Friday. Let's party. This is the way I party. Putting fake eyelashes on. You know, I'm acting like I know what I'm doing over here. Never said I was a professional. I'm not sure I'll like be online. Well, I I mean I'll definitely be online and stuff like that. But I'm sure that I'll uh you know, record a video here and there. I'm still thinking about like what I'm gonna do for the weekend. We had plans to uh go to one of my husband's family members for, um, for like a barbecue tomorrow. Unfortunately, we found out that they're not feeling well. So, um, the plans got canceled and, uh, you know, right. You know, we understand you don't feel good. You don't feel good. Um, so I'm trying to figure out like, what am I going to do? Is this the right way? Honest to Pete. I have never put lashes on. Uh, and I just sat there and lied to you. I did, but never these kind of lashes. I've tried the magnetic ones. Um, Uh, abort, abort, abort mission. The first time me and my husband went to Florida, I knew it like we were going there for, it was like Valentine's Day, but we got married in September. Uh, during, you know, during COVID, so. Hold on, guys, bear with me. Bear with me here. Uh, we got married, you know, in September 2020. So our, um, our, our wedding literally had 17 people and that included us. And so when we went to Florida for the first time as a married couple, it was in February. It had, you know, that vacation had already been planned. So he was like, well, let's kind of make it like, you know, a honeymoon type thing because we weren't able to travel when we got married and you know I'm like all right well whatevs so I went and I got these stupid magnetic ones that uh actually so easy so so easy um I think I have them here somewhere. I think the brand is called Ilure. 
Um, oh. And like, you know, you have the liquid liner and Alright, I mean, I think I did it. I'm going to keep these on and like, seriously, I'm going to keep these on and when my husband comes home, I'm going to be like, and he's going to think that I, I really have lost my mind. This side feels like it's just more curled. Like it's really curled more than the other ones. I don't know. I mean, I think I have them sitting correctly. So anyway, I got the magnetic lashes for Florida and, um, we went out to dinner and they were so small. Like they were so, so small. Like it, it didn't even, I said, what's the point of this? Because I have good lashes. I put mascara on. So, you know, I was like, what the hell's the point of me doing this? So I gave up on it, but they were really easy. And I was always intimidated by these that like have the, you know, you got to get the glue and all that nonsense. So when I found this and the adhesive, um, I feel like fucking Bert from Sesame Street. Like, uh, like my eyebrows are on my, my, my lash line. And it's just, this one's not sitting comfortably and I don't, oh fuck. I pulled it right off. Well, maybe it was, yeah, that's a good thing. Ah, oh, yeah, much better. Oh, it feels much better. Oh, child. Oh, my eyelash comb. I just never wanted to be bothered with the glue and the lashes and all that. And when I was going through some stuff here, cause I've mentioned that, you know, if I get to a hundred subscribers, I'd like to, you know, give a, a giveaway, you know, maybe like Venmo, I don't know, 20 bucks for some coffee or, you know, whatever. Yeah, you know, Sephora. Um, and that I'd keep my word. And I, in that, you know, said, hey, look, even if you want, if you see something that I use and I'm, you know, you know, it's in my donate bag, then uh, by all means, you know, let me know. If you're comfortable giving me your information. I mean, I know I ain't doing anything with it. So, I sent out a care package. And uh, when I was going through the stuff, I found this. I'm like, you know what? For shits and giggles, I'm going to try this shit out. Now, I don't know what it looks like. Um, they actually don't look bad for my first time. Okay? Don't break my balls. Don't make fun of me. Don't say I'm copying off a certain someone. I feel like the, um, the, the lashes itself had like a tackiness to them. Now, I don't know if they would have stayed. Again, this is my first rodeo, okay? But I'm telling you, I feel like I got a huge caterpillar on my eyeball. But 
the, the band was tacky. And then I guess the eyeliner is a little bit tacky too. I couldn't tell. I don't know. It's a peel adhesive liquid liner jet black. So. Just try and wing. At least wing it out a little bit. Can't see my mistakes. Sir. So, yeah, I ain't fucking with that. Anyway. The shit I do. The crazy nonsense I get myself into. Anyway. Uh, eyebrows are sisters, not twins. And uh, I tried. Trying to let that one grow out a little bit, but the scar isn't allowing the others to play nicely. And the first time I've ever used lashes. So, fun stuff. Now I am, I'm not in the mood for, I had the Sephora stuff on. I'm just not in the mood for any like tacky crap on my lips right now. Milk to the rescue. This is Milk Kush Lip Balm. The only one I like is the uh, Green Dragon. It's, it, I don't, the other ones have color in them and I don't like how they, um, how they look. Stila, absolute love it. Um, it's just. One final swooshy swoosh wipe. I know my channel's boring, everyone. I appreciate you tuning in. Um, please like the video. Um, you know, and I, I obviously I don't have that many people, but I do have conversations in the in the comment section. So, um, you know, tell me I look like an ass in all caps too. Especially you, hot dog. But this is the final look. Um, Stila and uh, my goofy ass eyelashes that I've never worn before in my life. I just found in my... I found the lashes somewhere. And then I found the eyeliner. And I was like, I have a adhesive eyeliner? What the hell is that? And then I was like, oh. They probably did come together. And I searched it up. So... Um, again, I feel like I have, uh, you know, I feel like there's something there. I don't think in person that it looks bad, but who the fuck am I? I, don't know. I never wore them before. So... Hopefully, we get some action this week with uh, Numb Nuts. I think their holiday was last weekend and ours is this weekend. So, I hope that all of you have a fantastic Memorial Day weekend. Whatever it is you're doing, whether you're going um, on a little uh, long weekend getaway, if you're in a shore destination and you're going to head down the shore, um... You know, I personally have lived in this area my whole life and I don't go anywhere near Jersey Shores when uh, it's a holiday weekend. But if you are, I hope you thoroughly enjoy yourself. You reboot and, you know, if you have to work on Monday, I'm sorry. Um, but think of that. Like, just kind of keep in mind what this long weekend is all about. Um, you know, they... they uh, they served our country and were serving our country and um, they deserve a thanks. So I will see you guys soon. Bye.